Two oceanfront summer homes catch fire in Dartmouth. The flames lighting up the skies around Salter Points. Katie Brace is at the scene right now with what we are learning. Katie? Well, Liam, this is an exclusive community where generations of families come mostly to summer. When firefighters received the call, they knew it would be a challenge to save but one house, and in part because of the wind here, a challenge to make sure those flames didn't spread. It was just like a tinderbox. It was like a matchstick. The whole thing was just completely in flames. It was awful. Jane Zimmerman took this video of her neighbor's house burning to the ground. She is one of a handful of full-time residents in the mostly summertime community of Salters Point. Thankfully, they weren't home. The homes are around 100 years old and balloon framed, meaning they go up fast. I just panicked as to whose house it was. It was rolling. A massive fire. That's what greeted firefighters after a neighbor called 911. Getting to the end of the point is one of the furthest distances Dartmouth Fire has to travel. It takes them 10 to 15 minutes to get here. It was approaching that home. The trucks had to stop one home before the firehouse, the fire, the home on fire because the fire was rolling across the street. It was serious. Firefighters were able to stop the flames from crossing the street. They were able to save the house directly next door, keeping the flames to an outside wall. The original house on fire, though, could not be saved. This is an incredible place. The people are incredible, and um, houses can be rebuilt. The fire marshal's office will now determine the cause of the fire. I'm told the family who owns the house was here just a few weeks ago and had been planning to spend Thanksgiving here as well. Reporting in South Dartmouth, Katie Brace, CBSN Boston. Katie, thank you.